Hi, this is Gabe Newell. I work at Valve, and I'm here at GDC to talk about our upcoming games and what we're doing with Steam. When we look out at what's happening in the next year, a couple of things are really exciting. We're going to be releasing the 10-foot UI to Steam. We're going to be releasing Dota 2. Now, I travel a lot, and the idea that I could be playing one of our next generation games like Dota 2 on something as light and as thin as one of these Ultrabooks seems like science fiction. Working with Intel is great. The impact they can have on millions and millions of consumers is hugely significant in terms of moving our business forward, of giving us those opportunities in storytelling and gameplay that matters to more people than any other platform. Working with Intel is exciting because of the tools they give us, whether it's their compiler technology, their profiling tools. I mean, a platform is only as good as it lets the software developers be. And that's where Intel excels. They give us what we need to build the games that consumers want to play. You know, when you're working on performance, you can't make it faster unless you know where it's slow. And something like VTune gives us an insight into exactly what's going on. VTune is a great example of how Intel gives developers such as ourselves what we need to build great consumer experiences. Sandy Bridge was a real milestone. The fact that you could get that much power in the CPU and the GPU and that kind of functionality in something that uses so little power and takes up so little, little space was a watershed for everyone in the gaming industry. It's really easy for us to take advantage of it. And that's one of the great things about the PC platform and the way that Intel keeps driving it forward. Tick tock, tick tock. That makes a huge difference to us as developers and to gamers as well. So I really want to thank Intel for everything they've done to move our industry forward. With an engine like Intel, we're all going to benefit everyone in the PC gaming space. If you want to learn more about Valve, you can go to www.valvesoftware.com.